Dubai, filming a little video for Animated Science. So we've gone to uh, Mauritius, the Maldives, now we're looking at Sea Urchin in Dubai. So we found these little sand dollars. These are quite incredible. I'm going to try and get out the sun a little bit. Hopefully you can see they are extremely flat. They've got amazing sort of textures on the surface like a star. You've got spikes on this part, that's what they use to move around. If we turn it over, if you look, you can see there the orifice in the centre quite well I think. Now I'm getting spiked as it starts to feel its way because what it does is it's got these little spines. If I put it back in the water and it uses the spines to move about, you see. So if we let it get a bit of water. I doubt if I focus, I probably can't see the spikes. It's hard to see because it's so bright with the sunlight. You might be seeing some spikes. I can see some tiny ones. It's definitely a sea urchin, it's a very hard shell. It's illegal in Dubai to take these out of the water, so we have to leave them in the water. You can take the shells if they come out of the water. They're all different colours. This one's a, a very nice purple with some really amazing patterns. I'll turn it over again. Oh, you can have another look. There we go. Like I said, you, you can clearly see the orifice. And uh, the anus actually is on the back. You see the little hole there? That's his anus. His mouth's at the front, say he, which is unusual for sea urchin. So you can see again, so that part there is the back and then the sides. And I'll let him go back in the water. We're only in very shallow water, I'm just standing up. Off he goes down to the bottom. 